Hey everybody, thank you for tuning in to my channel. So today I'm actually here to show you guys how I refresh my uh, week old bun, okay? It is very tired. I have a mirror right here, so I'm going to be looking at it. It's very tired. It's very frizzed out. It's, it's just not looking cute, okay? I'm giving y'all a 360 of the hair because I'm going to redo this and I'm going to show you guys how I do it. Uh, disclaimer, I'm, I'm going to say this now. I'm a struggling YouTuber. It is. I'm getting used to all of this, y'all, so... Please bear with me while I try and make this video for y'all, okay? Y'all just see my setup right now, but it's okay because, you know, I'm working on that, you know. I'm, we, 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 we building together, okay? So, let me just start taking this bun down so y'all can see what it looks like. And I usually try and stretch my bun as long as I can, honestly. Um... Especially if I'm not going nowhere, I usually just leave it alone. Um, but I, I work and I go to school as well. Uh, so if I'm going out somewhere, I have to make sure that, you know, my hair is looking decent. Um, as I'm taking this bun down, I'm just making sure I'm getting all the bobby pins out. Um, as I'm taking this bun down, I just want to let you guys know. I am transitioning to tech slacks. I have about shoulder length hair. I mean, my hair is tech slacks to my shoulders, and the rest down is relaxed hair. Okay, so I'm taking the pins out of the bun. Let you see that. I have a lot of bobby pins in here because it's very hard for me to make the bun stay. Uh, so I had to use a lot of bobby pins. I feel one in there, but for some reason I'm not able to get this out. Hmm. I'm just feeling around, just trying to make sure all the bobby pins are out. So far, that's, it feels like they're out, I think. So again, um, I gotta figure out how to put the music in here, y'all. But I'm not there yet. I'm getting there. So let me show you guys what the ponytail looks like taken out. So you probably won't be able to see the whole ponytail. My hair still smells so good. And I did my hair. I washed my hair a week ago. But I think it's because since I've had it in the bun, the smell like kind of just stuck in there. Um... I do a video on like my condition, my favorite conditioner, and I have a lot of other reviews for you guys too. Uh, I use two rubber bands to keep this tied up. So I'm just taking the rubber bands out. And oh, let me show you guys. I'm still old fashioned. I know a lot of girls use the, um, what is it, ouchless? But I still use the, um, the you know, the old-fashioned, you know, little rubber bands. I don't find that they damage my hair or rip my hair or anything like that, okay? So I am very glad to get my hands in my hair, you guys. Like, I'm starting to wonder if I should wash my hair sooner than two weeks. Uh, last time I washed it about at about a week and a half. Usually I do try and go two weeks, okay? But I'm wondering if I should, you know, increase that. But to be honest, you guys, I'm not sure if I should do that because I find that freaking wa frequent washing of my hair is too much manipulation. Um, so I try to reduce. I try to keep from manipulating my hair as much as possible. So let me show you guys what it looks like out of the ponytail. Can you see that? Okay. I'm showing you guys what I do. So when I run to refresh my ponytail, 
or anything i'm telling you guys i'm very low manipulation so i'm just gonna use water i use water in my hair for every style that i do okay i'm just gonna use water and i'm gonna smooth the top of my bun so you can just watch me while i'm doing that and i'm just putting water on the top i'm not i'm not like splashing it everywhere i'm not soaking my hair either and to be honest putting any additional product or like gel is really optional for me i don't always reapply product to my hair only because i find that my if my hair is properly deep conditioned and moisturized on wash day uh i shouldn't need additional product that's how I feel. I, I don't believe in, you know, moisturizing and sealing daily. Um, I don't believe in applying, applying product daily, okay? I find that if I'm, if I have properly deep conditioned and moisturized my hair, I shouldn't need to reapply product, okay? So, I'm just smoothing my hair right now. I'll let you guys see. How it's looking and it's pretty is wet enough to my liking at this point okay again it is just damp alrighty so now that I got the water in I'm gonna let you guys see how it's just smoothing out okay I got the water in now I'm gonna just start forming it with my hands again I'm low manipulation I do not use any brushes in my hair whatsoever none okay um i use my comb to detangle my hair on wash day and that is it okay uh applying additional edge control uh is optional but i'm not gonna do that only because again i try not to mess with my edges too much um not saying i'm anti-edge control i do use it from time to time but i don't find that it's worth it because i can't find not one edge control that can let my edges down i don't know what it is y'all i need some help i need to dedicate a video to this because i need some help my edges will not lay down for nothing Thing. nothing I've tried has worked like if even if I put some edge control and put a scarf on it it is it's puffy like it doesn't stick um the scarf lays it down for like two minutes and then I look at it again and it's fuzzy there is nothing no type of edge control that I've used that's actually laid my edges down so I just don't find it to be worth it so I just don't use it that often okay so now i'm just taking two rubber bands and i'm putting the um putting the rubber band around my ponytail let me show you and i'm stuffing it through okay and i let it go i don't wrap it around more than once okay and then this is my ponytail again my hair is a lot more smoother uh, show you the back of my ponytail okay and I'm gonna just show you guys how I roll it back up so I take the edge the end sorry of my ponytail and I wrap it under and I just roll it under like a French roll wait let me do that again do that again let me look at the mirror actually so I got, I'm gonna show you guys. I just need to make sure I got my form right. Okay, I'm gonna roll it under like a French roll. And see how it's kind of formed a little bun? I will use my bobby pins to pin this bun in place. Okay, so I'm gonna do that now. I'll make sure I got the base which is closest to my nape to make sure that the to make sure that the roll doesn't like come out or unravel so I make sure I at least stick uh, two pins like that and I could tell I need another one over here I'm just gonna 
pin it until I feel like it's able to stay on its own. Okay, so right now it's already sticking on its own. I'm just going to put a few more in. Put another one over here. All right, and my bun is done. Uh, I put two in the bottom to keep the ends, you know, tucked. And I put two on the sides to kind of, you know, form it a little bit better, okay? Um, on the top sides, all right? And um, lastly, what I would do, I would put my scarf on, tie it down with a scarf, and that's it. I will go to sleep and my hair will be nice and flat in the morning. Okay, y'all. Thank you guys for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you please subscribe and tune in for my future videos. Thank you guys for watching. Bye-bye.